Wow, this is pretty abandoned, like... First of all, let me check to see what I can steal at this point, because no one's here, no one's going to use them, why not? Holy shit. Thank you. Alright, so besides me taking all these things, I'm definitely here for other reasons as well. Such as finding out what happened during the whole massacre. So I'm also looking for potential clues. So far, nothing yet. Ooh. I am just loving the fact that I'm finding all of this. Like... Ooh. Huh. So much money laying around. This is amazing. Ah, too bad I don't have enough to hack that, but... Let me see what this thing is. What's this? Um, tunnels are in. Cables are laid. Devil's Peak is receiving, but we're waiting on signal confirmation from the outposts. This whole place stinks of sulfur. We shouldn't brought masks. I'm sure I heard something in the caverns beneath the tower. Something's living there. Here's hoping we don't unsettle it, or else that place ain't gonna be safe for our cable guys. We've got signal from Amber Heights, Stellar Bay, and Cascadia. Still waiting on word from Bayside, Terrence, and Aurora Ridge. I ought to note that I was right about those caverns. They ain't safe. Some kind of, hell, I don't know, a big thing with claws? I ain't an animal scientist. Can't wait to get the hell off this, ra this rock. <laughs> I said rock. So a big thing with claws, I mean, kind of sounds like... <sighs> Fallout 4 issues. It should be noted that the lead engineer, Franklin Valkowix, has perished due to a workplace accident involving hostile wildlife in the Devil's Peak Caverns. It should be further noted that Mr. Valkowix complaints regarding the dangers of the Terra 1 wildlife have been redacted. <gasps> Yo, they hid his complaints and concerns? This notice issued on January 12, 2343, serves as the public denouncement of Terra 1 as a feasible workplace environment. Okay, I read this already back in the other station, so they're leaving within six months, blah, 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 blah. Gonna die for this damn fool, Aaron, I know it. He said the Amra Heights was gonna have more bits than we can spend, but those suited morons up and spend it all for us. Books and vases and pretty shit. You can't eat a fucking book. Look at us now. Of all the closets to coop up in and lick your wounds, we had to choose the one that's set to lock itself up. Feel like a marauder digging at the walls like this. But we gotta get out before we starve. It ain't possible, but Nelson over there is trying to keep our spirits up, and I don't got the energy to fight him on it. Screw that bright fella. Eyes bigger than his fucking stomach. That's messed up. Cut it out, please. Rude. Alright, so since that is all that we are able to find, let's go over to Zora and deliver her that little information cartilage that we just found. What did Stellar Bay's engineer name your candy machine? I don't rightly know. That'd have been Guster, I think. I'd ask him, but he fell in the machine once, so. Oh. Call it Guster's demise or oh. Guster Crusher. Oh. oh. That's got a ring to it. I love how. Exactly. I love how you're so nonchalant about someone else's death. Like that is so crazy. Welcome back. You find anything out there? I found a box of data cartridges. Let's see. These are old. 
Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Some bits here, some there, some... Wait. This... This one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it. Just like the one I found earlier. And here's... A letter. Wait, this is from Graham. Wait, what? Oh, of all the... Wait, the Captain. What? He gave them the gate codes. Oh! <gasps> what? He caused the attack? Yeah. He did. He really did. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but... I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? Thank you for bringing this back, but I need some time. I gotta think. I'll let you know if I figure something out. I am so zor sorry, Zora, that... Are we gonna get in trouble today? Not that I want to. Just seems to happen around you, is all. Uh, we'll talk later. Ooh, the fact that Graham is the one that's the cause of this. What's up? Can I ask you something? What's with the pleasantries? You want to know something, just ask. What made you choose the hunter life? I didn't. I was born into security detail. And when the corporations abandoned this place, I stayed. Why did you stay? It's all I know. Besides, I had a few friends here and they were staying too. Fair enough. I call this Rotting River on account of all the dead things I've thrown in it over the years. It'll take you into the Devil's Peak Caverns if you follow it under the bridge. That's one option. Others, the slope up. If you're up for some fun, let's chat. So while I wait for Zura to let me know exactly what she wants to do with Graham, I'm going to help Nyoka with her quest on finding her friend's grave. So far, I just see nothing but animals here in that nasty little plague thing. This should be pretty fun. Oh lord. Ooh, the fact that that monster got killed. I got you. I got you. Oh my god, that's nasty. Ugh, I could only imagine what those little nasty ass bugs did to her face. Are you okay, Parvati? Ooh, you're not okay. Um. The caves back east are safest. We can head up this path if you want to shoot your way through a few nightmares on your way up. Cool, we could do that. I'm in the mood to shoot anyways. Had a long day at work. Oh, another one. Ew. Fucking bugs. Ooh. This is nasty. What the hell? That thing's not dead yet? No, that's my friend. And then the bugs. Nasty ass bugs. Alright, we're doing good so far. Beautiful, beautiful. My companions are alive, thank god, because they're awesome like that. Yeah, I don't like that sound. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna not run towards them. Hopefully they ignore me. What the hell? Okay. Wraps. Let's clear the sulfur sodden fucks out so Hayes can rest in peace. I got you. I got you. Yeah, that thing is pretty dead. Oi! What the hell is that? <gasps> Nyoka! 
You good? Oh, that's just... Burnt her crisp. I like this pistol, though. I gotta admit. This thing right here is hardcore. Alright, so this is the grave, huh? Buried near the surface of Hain's grave is a small lockbox. Its hinges rusted through and its wood almost completely rotted. It nearly falls apart in your hands, but in it, you manage to find a tarnished silver medallion bearing the letters Sharon. Hayes was the best self-sacrificing son of a saint I ever met. Halcyon is worse off without him. Now, if we're gonna lure the Manta Queen out, we'll need to find Rebecca and Anders. They took a UDL contract on Terra 2. We never heard from them again. I think it's time I call in a favor with Hiram. If anyone can track them down, it's him. Hold on, tell me about the UDL contract. I don't know much about it. It paid well, so they took it. They said they'd be back in a couple of weeks and that maybe we could all use the money to get off Monarch. That was a long time ago. You didn't try and find them? I should have. I, I really should have. But soon after they left, Hayes and the others died. Okay. And to be honest, after him, I, I stopped trying. Because it hurt like hell to do so. You know, for what it's worth, I'm glad you're trying to confront it. Thanks. I'm still not convinced I won't come to regret it, but we've started down this path. Might as well see it through. Maybe it'll stop me screaming at night. Now come on, let's make tracks before Hiram dies of old age. This is fun, isn't it? Nice views, a little exercise and fresh air. Well, and sulfury, spory air. It is a trek, isn't it? Almost like we don't have working lifts or roads. I can tell you're pretty nervous, and Nyoka, let's go. There's so many bugs here, a dead buddy. Clear this all out and get to it. Here I go. Oh, shit. I hate when those teleporters through. Their nasty acid at us. Ooh. Thank God. Whoa! Shit! What the hell? Oh my God, I'm running out of bullets. Come on. Ooh, that thing scared me. Lord have mercy. And now we're all on fire, literally. I don't like it either, but this too shall pass. See, told you. This too shall pass. Damn, so much dead bodies here. And they were not the last. All right, so we are going to the broker. That way, he can definitely, or she, whoever, can definitely help us. Now, question is, how bad is this area? Fuck my life. I thought this was going to be an easy mission, but it's not. I almost feel sorry for that thing, but... These little filthy animals are just plain nasty. And why are they so huge? Like, they have no excuse. Ooh. Of being this huge. Like, no excuse. Ooh. 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 There you go, see? Oh, it's the bugs. You're on your own for that one. Ugh. I can't see! Ugh. I'm sorry. 
Oh lord. I feel bad. I'm sorry. Nyoka? Oh no, you too. Honey, it's okay. It's gonna fade. I promise you. It's gonna fade away. And here we are. Told you we'd make it in one piece. Station ain't too far now. Hey, you. Get over here. Oh no. How the hell did Marauders navigate the caverns? Well, we will see. I always wanted to poke through a high gain wireless. They only got one on Terra 2, you know, up in Byzantium. This station's under the protection of the corporate compliance crew. Okay. You a Marauder? No. Cause me and my sunshine, that's my gun if you were wondering. We I'm don't not. take kindly to Marauders. Uh, sure, I'm totally a marauder. Yes, indeed. Hmm. Reckon that sounded far too coherent for a marauder. That's good. Otherwise, I'd have to kill you. I was being sarcastic. You're clear. But I would caution you against pressing on ahead. This station's plumb crawling with marauders, you know. What are you doing up here hunting marauders? I take it you ain't met the other C3s. No. Me and Sunshine are doing exactly what we've been tasked with. You want more details? You ought to talk to my crew. They're guarding a small barracks to the southeast, by the edge of the mountain. Um, what are you waiting for? Help me kill these marauders. There is nothing I'd enjoy more, but the C3s play it by the book. Of course. Go petition the boss man. Maybe you can convince him to alter my duties. How do I find the other C? Three S. I don't know. See that path that runs underneath that giant archway? Follow it on down. There's a little station near the cliff. You'll find the rest of my crew there. Okay, I'm off. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Anyways, let's go to the broker. What the hell? Yeah, let's bully him. We're gonna go bully the tall one here. Because why not? She shot air. Oh! 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 I got you, I got you. Damn, she's just kicking that shit. Okay, okay, first of all... Let me go and scavenge because I just love stealing shit. Don't mind me. Anyways, stop wasting your time. I just realized something. Parvati is down, so... Nyoka is hanging on. Yeah, I hear her. Are you serious, my boy? Like... Come here, come here, pull up, pull up, finally. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, Ooh, I'm sorry. <gasps> Honey, please wake up, please wake up, please, I'm about to fucking cry, please wake up. I swear to God, if you're the reason why Pravati's dead, I'm gonna mess you up. Look at this bitch boy running. Come on, Nyoka, let's go. Let's go. Let's get him. There you go. There you go. See? Who's next? Damn, his armor ate a lot of bullets. Come on, are you serious? I got you, I got you. Flamethrower? Really? Really? Damn, she just whacked the living shit out of him. See, I'm I'm glad Nioka's on my team. I hope Parvati's okay. I feel bad. Where'd she go? Yeah, hey, where'd she go? Who's that? Nice. Alright, she's waking up now. Thank goodness. I got so sad. I don't like seeing my companions down like that. That shit's depressing. Hiram must have sealed the door. He's... he's too easy. Oh, so he a pussy. Cool. Good to know. 
All right, so let's go this way then. Ooh, all right. Ready? Let's ride. What the hell? Oh my god, there's a whole bunch of bad guys here. You may not realize oh. being as you're an outsider, but the blaring alarms indicate the station's on lockdown. Which means you can't ever get to me. So leave already. <laughs> can't? We'll see about that. No. Incoming! There you go. Oh shit! Oh! 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 O'Reilly! That's the last of them. Ugh, man. That... Wow, I literally blew off his body. That is insane. And yes, I'm searching. See why I can take. Don't judge me. Thank you. Man, there's so much stuff. Yes, I'll take some liquor. Okay, so I sold enough where I was able to have room for more stuff if I was interested in taking. Uh, ain't gonna budge while this place is on lockdown. Yeah. I guess we keep moving forward. Look for another way up. Which I assume it's over here. Because, you know... Why not make it semi-convenient, you know? Ooh, what's in here? Weapon parts? Carlage? Yes! I just love taking shit, like... Why not? Damn, this place is all packed up. Barb, the new environmental controls terminal is now installed and running upstairs. Congratulations, you message Corpora about it. You get to manage it. Consider this your official notice to hide its access keycard deep in the bottom of a drawer somewhere. Preferably within the archives or in one of the station's other popular sections. Because I sure as hell will now allow our station's efficiency scores to plummet due to a pointless safety feature. Don't even think about testing the system out. The emergency sirens will make your ears bleed. And if you accidentally trigger the fire suppression system, it can suck the air from the room faster than the station's last performance review. The amount of microaggression from that note alone is astonishing. Ooh. All right, let's head over here and, huh? You out there, whoever you are, yes, yes, I can see you. Come me? Talk to me. Face the intercom. Oh, okay. I can't tell if you're brave or simply touched in the head. Both. What galaxy are you doing sniffing around my station? Your and station? You are, in fact, trying to suicide by Marauder. And you, Neoka. What are you doing lugging a stranger into my station? Hey! You could use the socialization, you son of a bitch. Also, she hired me. To what purpose? I happen to have some significant problems I am dealing with right now. Marauders, running out of purpleberry wine three days ago, not being able to bloody broadcast. I need to see the information broker about... No, no, no. We'll deal with information-related business later, as I oh. said. Okay. There are bigger problems threatening my life and livelihood at this very moment. The Marauders want me dead. And since my hired hands have clearly turned idle, it appears I need you to clear out the threat. Of course. As my newest contractor, you may call me the Broker. Or we can call you Hiram, on account of that's your damn name, and doubly on the account of the Broker being a dumbass alternative. Oof. What? Everyone calls me that. Aside from you... Why me? You're here, and you're armed, aren't you? The feed's gone grainy, but it looks like you're packing deadly force. I know Nioka is, for sure. I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. They destroy the transmission equipment, and I'll be out of business. 
The elevator and doors to the second floor are back online. Hurry before I have to lock them down again. How many marauders broke into the station? Too many, considering I hired a bunch of no-good mercs to keep them out in the first place. Already they've caused considerable damage to the station's property. If they take down the broadcast equipment, I'll be out of a job. Permanently. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Okay, so... The... Marauders are upstairs. Let's head on in. Got it. Alright, let's head out. I am so ready for this. This would be a lot more appropriate. Ooh. Ah, oh, look at them. Okay. Surprise, motherfucker! I am so happy I got companions. That guy thought he he was gonna do it. Like as if, buddy, as if. I got Nyoka and Pavati on my side, bro. You leave her alone, asshole. Oh great, hold on, hold on. He is eating a lot of my bullets. Holy shit! So we killed everyone. Sweet. Damn. Okay, this is cool. So... Ah, we have a whole bunch more to go. How the hell are they standing still? Knowing I just massacred half of their buddies. Like, that is so... Hilarious to me. Is that milk? Yeah. No, that's water. Okay. All right, let's head upstairs, finish cleaning out these cockroaches, and then we'll see the broker from here. Watch out! Oh, we got big boy now, huh? With the flamethrower? Okay. Come on, come on, we got this. Damn, he went down. Shit. All right. Ah, marauder free at last. I'll get the door. You hurry on it. Okay. Ah, you're haram. And you have your two robots. How nice indeed. Thank you for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.